This time on Survivor Team, we're heading to the Deep South, about an hour away from the city of Baton Rouge. I'm finishing up a great year with a New Year's Eve four-wheeling trip, but I expect to be home for dinner. That's how it happens. You come down a trail you don't know, don't know where it goes, and something like this happens and you're stranded in the middle of the woods and you have to survive. What you need to do is assess the situation. I don't know where I'm at really because I'm lost. I mean, obviously, I'm lost. So, first, I need to see what I have, okay? It's kind of stupid. I didn't bring very much stuff with me, but I do have. Ugh. A water bottle right here. I've got a knife. I mean, you always gotta have a knife. Let's see what else I got? Hmm. I have a flint. That is gonna be useful right there. Got a hat. Help keep me warm, I suppose. Pretty sweet sunglasses I got for Christmas. These are amazing. Um. And then I've got a waterproof jacket, a shirt, and a fleece deal. It's waterproof pants, so I should be all right. Pretty sweet, huh? All right, so now, in this situation, you might want to stay with your vehicle, but that wouldn't be very exciting, so I'm going to find my way back to civilization. First thing you need to do in a situation like this is assess your bearings. I have no idea where I am, but the best way to figure out what to do is to climb a tree. This looks like a great tree to me. Okay, well, I climbed this tree. My forearms are burning right now, but I can see that it looks like I need to go that way. I'm not really sure why, but I just got that, you know, feeling from within. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, yeah, I'm going to go that way once I get down. Ugh. Oh, I'm tired. I need to get down fast. Let's see what this tree does. Oh, this isn't quite working out. Oh well. <coughs> That's how you get down from a tree. Alright, well, I've got myself together. I'm gonna try and make it out. I'm pretty sure there's a road this way. I don't know how far. But let's go on an adventure. When I'm walking in the woods, I always like to have a good hiking stick. You know what I'm saying? Fend off werewolves and vampires and that kind of stuff. This looks like a pretty nice stick to me. Chop down my knife.
see how much sunlight I got left. I got one, two hand widths. So that's about two hours. So then you start looking for some camp. You know what? This looks pretty good in here. Got this nice sun spot. Kind of protected from the wind with all these trees in here. A little bit of rain protection from this limb right here, as you can see that. So I need to work on my shelter. I think I'm going to put it right here. I've been thinking about my shelter, and I'm thinking the best way to stay warm is to get underground, have the thermal insulation, you know what I'm saying? So I've got my stick here that I cut down, as you all remember. And I've been uh, kind of hacking at it into a kind of shovel shape. See that? See that shovel shape? So I'm going to work on digging my shelter now, and we'll just see what happens. All right, it's been about 20 minutes, and here's my shelter so far. Looks pretty great, doesn't it? So yeah, I'm going to keep going, make it a little bit longer, a little bit deeper, a little bit wider, basically everything. I'm going to fill it in with insulation afterwards, make a roof. That's a five-star hotel. Jack Link's Beef Jerky presents Messing with Sasquatch. Hey, you want to ride? It's okay. <laughs> sorry. We're sorry. Sorry, buddy. Sorry, buddy. <laughs> 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 Jack Link's Jerky. Feed your wild side. Start really fast. My shelter isn't quite done yet, so I'm at this giant oak tree. I probably came down in a hurricane or something, and I'm getting firewood. So I cannot freeze and finish my shelter. I don't know what the freaking heck that was, but, um... Alright, well, it's night time, and I'm still working on my shelter, I'm having issues with it, but, I mean, I guess you gotta learn somehow, and it's a beautiful night, we've got the moon, really bright, so, I don't even know if the camera can pick all this up, but basically, we can walk around without any light, so, we're going to find some more, um, I'm gonna look for some, some pine branches to throw on my shelter, I'll make it basically turn into a giant 